Okay. Obviously, yeah, it was a difficult day, and as always, we analyze and we do the tough, yeah, the reality. It was a reality check, so we have to learn from it and then carry on. Um, yes, in case of Rafa, I, I have good hope. Um, Harry will take a little bit longer, and the other two, I cannot give a prognosis. No, the responsibility is, is, is playing for this massive club. Everyone has to, to feel the same responsibility. Uh, we have to share that. Um, doesn't matter who, who has the armband on the, on the pitch. Obviously, we know that being captain for this club is, is such an honour, but I think the responsibility is, is for, for the badge we have on the chest, and, uh, and that, that is the biggest responsibility we can have. I can't see so that, uh, that relation that he is not... Coming on uh, when when we are four 0 down, five one down, six one down, uh, and I don't bring him out of respect. So it's nothing to do what's uh, what's happening uh, for the future and what's happening for January or next year. At the same time, Ronaldo is someone who obviously wants to play. So from the conversations that you have with him, what would you gauge about his mood at the moment? How happy? And if he is unhappy, does it make sense to keep a player like that? Yeah, I don't see he is unhappy. So he, he is happy, he's training well, he's enjoying. I think everyone is training well. There's a good spirit and, and vibe on the training. So um, that's not that's not the point. And but but it's important because it's a base to work well. And what contribution then do you still see him making this season and obviously I presume you still see him making that contribution beyond January. Oh, you know, we, you, uh, everyone knows. What do you expect from from strikers? Uh, first, production, and second, also in football, it's eleven. Uh, nowadays, football eleven defend, uh, eleven attack. So everyone has to contribute. No, I know when you are going in a process, uh, it will not go only uh, upside. Uh, you will have setbacks, and uh, we beat the number one in the league. Uh, we need. We beat Liverpool uh, on Sunday. We had a bad day. Bad day at the office. Clear, and then we got beaten. And um, and uh, in this moment, uh, on that day, City was was better. Uh, we have to accept that. But what we can't accept is our performance. That was unacceptable. No, we don't. We don't. We don't have to focus on uh, anyone else. We have to focus on ourselves. That has been the problem for the club in uh, in the previous years. That we want to compare ourselves with other teams. We can't do that. We have to do the best we can for this club because this club deserves to be at the top. But we have to look at ourselves. We have to look inside and understand where are the problems, where are the mistakes, what we can improve. Because you can't change anything away from here. You can change what you do here the, on the day by day, on the training sessions, on the games. You can you can do different things for yourself, for your team, uh, and that is what we have to think, not about uh, Arsenal, Liverpool or wherever. We have to think at, at ourselves, doing the best we can, win every game that we have in, uh, in our hands, and, and the future will say where we, have, where we have to be on the table, if it's first, second, third, fourth, or even lower. It's, it's the, it, that's what you always do, so um, that you take respect of the opponent, huh? but we will stick to our philosophy. Hey, we will stick to our rules or our principles, but that's tactic. Sometimes you, um, in your tactic, you uh, also to surprise opponents. Hey, you have to to bring something different than your game, and we will do uh, also for the future. And but I think well, what's good? I think we can uh, get a lot of confidence about this series when you beat Arsenal, when you beat Liverpool, and now we get a reality check uh, with Man City. Uh, so we know uh, that we. We, we have to step up, and, um, and that is so. Thank you for the lesson uh, from Pep and City. Huh? But we will take that, huh? and we have to understand we have to do things much better. Oh, he is not happy that he wasn't playing Sunday. Don't get me wrong, but that wasn't the question. The question was how he was always on the training pitch and what his mood is when he is around. And yeah, then, um, then, then uh, he's happy. Um, but of course he wants to play and he's off when he's not playing. Yeah, clear.